Yes, so now we are discussing about uh, snacks making business and in that uh, today we are discussing about aluminum foil for snacks packing. Aluminum foil is made from an aluminum alloy which contains uh, between 92 and 99 percent aluminum. Usually between 0 0.00017 and 0 0.0059 inches thick foil is produced in many strengths and widths of, uh, for uh, literally hundreds of applications. Which side of aluminum foil is toxic? Since aluminum foil has a shiny side and a dull side, many cooking resources say that when cooking foods wrapped or covered with an aluminum foil, the shiny side should be down facing the food and the dull side up. What is aluminum foil made of? Aluminum foil is made for an aluminum alloy which contains between uh, 92 and 99 percent aluminum. Is parchment paper safer than aluminum foil? Yes, when roasting vegetables, parchment paper is better than foil. People who cook often with aluminum foil risk more exposure than normal to the metal. And next point is, is aluminum malleable or brittle? A metal that you can hammer into the sheets, into this, into thin sheets is malleable. Gold, silver, aluminium, iron and copper are malleable. Non-malleable metals such as tin will break apart when struck by a hammer. Next point is, will aluminium rust? Aluminium corrodes, but it doesn't rust. Rust refers only to iron and steel corrosion. Aluminium is actually very prone to corrosion. However, aluminium corrosion is aluminium oxide, a very hard material that actually protects the aluminium from further corrosion. And next point is, does aluminium retain heat? It does get hot, but since it is so thin and an excellent thermal conductor, it radiates or conducts away all of its heat so rapidly that it cools off much faster than anything else. Actually, aluminum foil does get hot when it is in the oven. Next point is, is aluminum a pure? Pure aluminum is a 99 percent is quite soft and weak. Commercial aluminium with small amounts of silicon and iron is hard and strong. Ductile and highly malleable aluminium can be drawn into wire or rolled into them into thin foil. The metal is only about one third as dense as iron or copper. Especially for tins and snacks packing aluminium Packing also aluminum foil are using. School children tiffin boxes they are using heavily to protect the food. This is the information regarding aluminum foil, especially for uh, chapatis, puris, and uh, idli and doshas. All these will be packed in aluminum foil for controlling some heat and as well as it is a proof of uh, food also from paper. This is the information regarding aluminum foil. So if you want to do aluminum foil making, you can do it and manufacturing process. You can see so many videos and uh, Google text also you can get it. But one thing is once if you want to start independently, first you should have a project report with the MSO document. Then step, um, step by step, what are the raw materials you should purchase and what is the machinery you should purchase what are the skilled labor you should take, all these things you should step, step by step process you should have a MSO document. Then if you implement the document you can do independently. But uh, the land should be worn because the, some space is required. Suppose if you go for rental again it is uh, for the time being demand increased your rent also will be increased. Likewise if it is uh, your own land or as you purchase some land, then it is good for you. Or otherwise you can take lease for 10 years or something. Then it will be very nice to you to comfortable business. So wishing you all the best.